When you have a doorway that looks out of place and takes you nowhere, call today's homeowner for an entry upgrade. It's a perfect, perfect place to enjoy a beautiful spring day like today. upgrading this awkward entry for Jonathan and Paige to help it match the character of their home. The old porch has to come down first so it can be reconfigured <laughs> to support a roof. That means placing new posts inside the joists of the porch and securing them with facetting concrete which will allow us to almost immediately rehang the steps. Later, the columns that support the roof will sit directly on top of these posts. Next, we reattach the porch surface, this time just a little higher. So what do you think now that we raise this up, you don't have that big step down, it just seems to, to work a lot better, huh? Yeah, absolutely. The step down was always awkward. And the biggest bulk of the work will be on creating this nice inviting walkway out to the swing. Great. So we talked to them a few weeks ago about the walk maker, mm -hmm. and you selected this particular pattern which mm -hmm. I think is great. So we lay out the forms to determine our spacing and we're ready to mix concrete. To continue the gray theme we're adding a charcoal color cement dye to the water we're using to mix the concrete. Then it's a simple matter of shoveling the mix into the leveled forms and packing it down. Well what's going through my head when we're using the walk makers is how do you get the mold off the cement? How do you fill all the cracks? How do you make sure that it's all leveled out? And all these things, Danny had just a small little hint. Okay, get right here, grab it on that end, and scissor it back and forth. Now let's go towards this, walk to the house. Go to the house. See, I would have never known. Okay, now go back this way. Boy, just explaining to Jonathan how you have to tap the forms around it to prevent the honeycombing on the concrete really gave me a flashback. When I, my very, very first job, when I was about 14, and this is what I did, tap forms. Vibrating like that will take all the honeycombs off the side. Oh, wow. So you just vibrate it like that. That's all you gotta do. You're not hitting it hard. It's just vibrating it. There, that one's done. And what do you, what you mean by honeycombs is the bubbles, air bubbles? Yeah, just air bubbles on Pockets. the side. And I think we accomplished that very thing with these projects.